Check out G2A.com for great gaming deals and use code HATTON for a discount. Hello, welcome to Hatton Games. I am back with some more Overwatch and I've not done a case in a while, so hopefully it's going to be a good one. Review evidence, let's go, let's find some cheaters. I think it's been a while since we've seen some absolutely blatant cheaters, but hopefully the suspect can produce something special for us. Let's see, obviously he's on dust too. Uh, what round are we? It's literally the first round. Oh no. Oh, he's warm up. Must be warm up. He's got an AWP. Okay, so the game has gone live. He's starting on the CT side. And here we are going to turn on the X-ray so we can see the T's are four of them actually heading into the upper tunnel. So he's looking at lower. Depends if someone's going to actually cross into him though. But the bomb's been dropped into B. So he has rotated into the site. Waiting for the T's to come in. Picks up one kill. That guy was severely damaged. So quite an easy kill there. No one taps. Nothing special. And obviously he knows this guy is uh, in the upper tunnel. Probably. What's, <laughs> what's that guy doing? He's like trying to change his gun or something. Uh, that's an easy kill for the suspect. Picks up two so far. This guy is going to be running straight into him and he gets the assist for that one as well. So two pretty standard kills and one assist, nothing really special. It does get the MVP award for that round, so congratulations. Running up mid with a P90, getting these eco frags. Only one terrorist has bought armor, so this should be easy pickings for him. Actually, he gets taken down, so he should have had more there, I feel. Of course, he is top fragging at the moment with four kills. Probably gonna push this because it's matchmaking. No, actually. Okay, smokes it, flashes, throws a bit of spam down, and he's just gonna hide by the fence here. This is actually a position people don't really check if you're at lower ranks. And he might get rewarded because of it. Look, look at this. No one is looking at his position. All four of them, in fact. Picks up one, two, three. <laughs> the guy. The, guy, the fourth guy still didn't even know he was there. To be fair, he was actually distracted by his teammate who was at the door, but... There you go. I think he only got those kills because of his positioning and the awareness of the T's was absolutely terrible. So he's orping now, round four. Obviously this is a full buy for everyone. Gets a nice pick at mid there. And he's just probably going to be rotating in between window and the uh, scaffolding looking at mid to B and the B tunnels he know I think his teammate just got killed by someone at mid so he has to be aware of that and it looks like he's gonna see the guy drop into spawn gets the other guy actually misses the shot and obviously they all know where he is now so the bomb for the terrorists should be going to A but it looks like that guy's just sat in spawn in fact, it looks like that guy is coming to B with the bomb. That guy's a nutter. So uh, maybe that guy just wants the kill. So if this guy... Ah, there you go. It's fine. I was going to say, if that guy just died, then that, that would have been awkward. But there you go. The suspect, nine kills now. I mean, they did lose that buy round. So, you know, maybe he's, he's getting worried. Smokes into the B tunnels as usual. Jumps up onto platform. What's he actually got? He's got a FAMAS. Famas, so look at that, he's got Famas, and he's going back now. And it looks like a call's been made that the bomb is at A. They're pushing up short and they're pushed out at long. So that's why he's done the early rotation. And he's going to try and flank behind at long. Checking his corners slightly. Jump, yep. So he is checking the corners like left, close left, looking at blue. Gets a kill onto the ramp there, and he's seen the other guy. He knows that he's around Goose. So this should just be an aim duel. What is that guy doing? <laughs> it feels like that's the same guy that was just looking at the, uh, the gun on the ground again. What was he trying to do? But either way, you know, the, the CTs, they bring it back. One for one. Ten kills now. And he's gone with the AWP. Does not get that kill. He's actually got a nice nice looking safari mesh there. Here we go. 
He's going to try and retaliate through the smoke there. He heard the shot and he tried to uh, just guess where he, the other orphan might be. And he knows now... Oh, he really needed to hit one of those players. He knows that they're going to be potentially up short. He can hear them running straight. And his teammate actually kills that guy. So, he's going to go to long instead. Ah, but he gets pincered from short and long and gets taken down. Look at that. Looking into mid and he gets tagged up. Misses his shot. And he's on 19 HP now for the rest of the round. It's not looking good for the CT side. This is where you'd expect the suspect to toggle. Oh, I mean, he didn't really land that shot because he was sort of jumping and he shot at the same time. And he loses the orc jewel again. So not going too well. I mean, he is top fragging, but some of these jewels that he's taking, he's uh, losing a fair... A fair bunch of them. And they are eco now. Going to push long. This is some organised teamwork here. Look at that. Three nades into long doors. This is, a, this is a rare case of teamwork in matchmaking. But they should catch these guys behind. This guy looks like he's actually waiting for the CTs. And he's not seen him. He's got knifed. <laughs> he's been knifed. And that's it. That is the end of this Overwatch case. So... I'm going to say this is this was an easy one. I mean, this guy was no way. This guy was um, cheating, and he's uh, not war hacking, no aim assistance, nothing. Not even greeting. So uh, what a way to end it, getting knifed. So this guy is clean, and uh, he is good to go. So I hope you enjoyed this episode of Overwatch, guys. If you want to see more, let me know, and leave a like and a comment, and I'll see you next time. Peace.